welcome to this video where you will be learning how to make a project called color selector. Here you will be making a color selector, also a brush to select a color from the color selector and at last being able to change the size of the brush. Go to costumes tab and delete the second costume of the scratch cap and press delete on the first costume. Color is not necessary to choose. But you can choose any color. I'll take the purple one. Also set the outline to zero. Zoom as much as possible and click on the circle tool. Make a tiny circle and place it in the center. Go to the coding area and from events add a one green flag click block. Click on the bottom left of the screen and add an extension named pen. Go to the pen category and add a pen up block separately. Add an erase all block under the green flag and add a pen up block. Go to motions and add a go to x0 y0 block. From pen category a pen down block. Also to set pen color to 50 blocks, change both the blocks is 50 to 0. Change the second one to set pen brightness to zero. Go to my blocks category and make a new block called show color selector. Also press run without screen refresh. Add a show color selector block under set pen brightness to zero. Go to pen category and add a pen up. From controls a forever loop, if then loop and an if then else loop. For motions, go to a random position block inside the forever loop and change it to mouse point. Add the if then loop and from sensing a mouse down on the if then loop. Also, don't forget to add a key space press on the if then else loop. I'll start by naming this project Color Selector. You can name it whatever you want it to be too. Right click and press duplicate on the set pen color to zero block and delete all blocks under the set pen brightness to zero. Add the two blocks inside the if mouse down then loop. Also from sensing, add a mouse x and a mouse y block. Add mouse x on the zero of set pen curve to zero and mouse y on the set pen brightness to zero block. Then under the if then loop but inside the forever loop comes the if then else loop. From pen category, a pen down in the if then portion and a pen up in the else portion. Now, as we have used a newly made block called show color selector, but have not filled the defined portion, it will not work. So let's get to it. From controls, a repeat loop and inside it another repeat loop. Change both of the 10 numbers of the repeat loop to 100. From pen category, a set pen color to zero block inside the first repeat 100. Add a change pen color by one separately. For motions, add a move 10 steps on top. Change it to one and drag it inside the second repeat 100 loop. Add a pen up separately and add the next box under the pen up blocks. Set X to zero. Change pen brightness by one. Change Y by one. Pen down. Add a when green flag click from events. From controls, a forever and an if then loop. From sensing, a key space pressed. Change it to up arrow. Go to pen category and add a change size by 1 and change it to 0 0.1. And then drag it inside the if then loop. Separate the if then loop. Right click and press duplicate on the if then loop and drag it below the previous one. Change it down and drag it inside the forward loop. Change it to down arrow and change the 0.1 to negative 0.1. Also, I am sharing the project I am making so that if you have any doubts. Also, I am sharing the project I am making so that if you have any doubts, you can check its link down in the description below. Subscribe, like, share and ring the bell below so that you don't miss any of my cool videos. Bye bye and see you in my next video.